So recently I made a reaction to some wildlife from Canada, just getting a good overview of what wildlife is actually in Canada. And one of my viewers recommended this is called 30 Interesting Wild Animal Encounters in Canada. So actually encountering some of the wildlife in Canada. Tell me if you've what's the like, most interesting animal you've ever encountered yourself, if any. I mean I'm interested to see this. Let's watch. Beaver gives these two quite the scare. Oh. Jeez, I think shoots. That's actually majestic. Here is Looks a so rare cool. encounter between a lynx and a mountain lion. Mountain goats. <laughs> I don't think I'd want to get near either a lynx or a mountain lion. I guess they could both be quite vicious. Is there certain parts of Canada where they're more prevalent? Not even phase that I pull right up to them, eh? Like, what are you doing, bro? We're just eating gravel. Oh yeah, there you go, get a little spooked. I'll see if I can get close to one anyways. Beautiful animal. Mm. Whoa. <laughs> Whoa. A battle of the giants. Look at that. Not many things I've a seen scare away a bear man. That thing was gone. Tonight, in a stranger's house. I <laughs> I can't even believe that. It's just so so comfortable and found a perfect spot. Like I've seen a video from Scotland where someone recorded themselves walking down into the living room and there was a drunk guy sleeping on their sofa. Somebody just walked in their house during the night. This is a moose. How did it even get in the door? How did it open the door? How did it find such a comfortable spot in the bedroom? Can't even be mad at that. Oh no. I didn't realize bears could go down such steep things. Maybe it's not. He's like trying to touch this moose. It's not a good idea. Whoa. The moose whisperer? Whoa, look at the size of that thing. Have you ever seen a moose up close and personal? Let's go, licking arm. I'm talking to the goat. What? I'm talking to the goat. He's licking the salt off my arm. That's one friendly goat. <laughs> okay, that's enough. Where are the two? Oh, you got a good one. Wow, where is he? <laughs> Camouflage. Oh, yeah, now I got him. Apparently, beavers can compete in any weight division. A beaver and a bear fighting. Well, beavers are hardy little things. Big things. I didn't realize beavers were that big. When you compare it to a bear, it's actually not too small. It's feisty as well. Bears are taking some L's on these videos. Whoa. I can't imagine being in that situation where bears are just there. Never mind climbing all over the cars. I feel like I wouldn't be drawing attention to myself here. I'd just be letting them be. A mother bear and her cubs cross a busy road in the town of Banff. Oh, don't care. Oh, it's a baby! Oh my god! Oh my god. <laughs> oh, that is cute. Oh my god. Stop, 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 Super cute. Stop. Stop. <laughs> Get in, Dad. Dad, <laughs> let me in! Oh my god! <laughs> let me in. Dan, let me in! I'm in the middle. Oh, <laughs> oh, no, There's two babies. There's Why the f did you get out? Stop! 
Oh, look at those things. They're amazing. I've never seen a bear so small before. They actually move very differently. Of course, that, that kind of makes sense, but they are so nice. Thanks. <laughs> Try to kick out as well. Jeez. I'd actually be very scared there. Those things could probably be quite strong, I would imagine. No calm being nasty. <laughs> Come on. I wouldn't believe I just got my butt kicked by a calf moose. <laughs> Here are some beluga whales that are looking for some camera time in Churchill, Canada. Whoa. Canadian wildlife is next level. So beautiful, so many different beautiful things. A man confuses a puffin. <laughs> What's the chances that you could have a good puffin uh, noise in your repertoire of animal sounds and just so happen to meet a puffin as well? That's like probably the moment this guy's been waiting for, man. Bird? Hey, bird. Want something to eat, bird? Tell me what the what kind of birds are in Canada. What's the most unique ones? Any interesting ones? Can imagine there's a lot of really oh my cool goodness, ones. Baby. <gasps> Whoa. Seeing a, mo a moose must be one of the best encounters you could have with any animal. About 20 yards from the truck. So big this and is insane. imposing. I believe this. He wants me. Holy s***, and he's not scared. And... <laughs> Here is a rare encounter between a lynx and a wolf. Oh man, the Lynx likes to get involved in some fakes. So I'm working Past away in my one. office and I hear a knock at the front door. I go, well, maybe that's not a knock. So I take my camera out and a giant red-headed woodpecker. This guy is huge. No excuses. Look at him tear the wood out of there. Here is oh. how a bull elk sheds its antlers. I had no idea there was an animal like this. I knew I obviously have an elk, but I never knew they shed their antlers. That was really cool. Tell me if you knew that, if you've seen that before. I've actually, in, I've, one animal I have encountered is a, a massive reindeer. I was driving to a place in Scotland called Glencoe, and we were just driving, we kept stopping every so often. It was during winter, so there was like snowy mountains everywhere. We stopped in a car park, just to take photographs, and this like, a, again, a very majestic reindeer came with the spikiest antlers. So close, I've got video of it somewhere. It was so beautiful, man. I, I feel like, I feel like it would be like you seeing any of these. You feel like, really, like your breath gets taken away oh, when you see something like this up close. It's right in front of me. <laughs> Ooh. I wouldn't be putting the window down man. Oh no. That guy just wants to go for a morning jog. Just out in our natural These habitat in the middle of nowhere. Acknowledge cool. each other. Animals here are definitely feisty. 
Was that a rabbit attacking Here we see that? a lynx taking on a full-grown mule deer. <laughs> it's like some WWE move. Size is not an issue for some of these animals. It's like they're literally picking on the biggest thing they can see. Oh, beaver at work. Nice. Whoa. I wonder if squashed beavers are, are a problem. Have you ever seen a, a beaver that's been... Oh, jeez. Uh, uh, shut up. Get on video. I am. A beaver that's been flattened a by a tree. A huge 14-point bull elk is spotted in Saskatchewan. I didn't expect it to make that noise. Those antlers are fantastic. Here is an up close recording of a wolf in the wild. How do you get that close? The thing's so placid. No fear from the cameraman. Camera person. Yeah, I've seen this thing before. What is this? This makes me feel uneasy. As much as it does look very cool, something like a little bit off-putting about it. Thank that is that is a fantastic video, man. That really does show the beauty of the wildlife in Canada, big to small. I really like how aggressive some of them are. Just want to fight bigger animals just because, maybe to keep warm in the cold weather, I don't know. The moose... Man, I just like seen the next clip here, what is that, that thing there? That looks f frightening. But yeah, the moose... I think it's one of my ambitions to see a moose up close and personal, just see the, 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 like, the size of it. Tell me if you've ever seen a moose, what's the most impressive animal you've encountered in Canada? Tell me what you think about that video. Thanks.